number 65. Every field or court he's ever stepped on to play whatever game he's wanted to play, he's been the best athlete. That's his perspective. He doesn't know any other perspective. He doesn't know it any other way. I had Randy at a very pliable time. He was a rookie with a chip on his shoulder with those 20-some-odd teams that had passed him by. I'm going to come here and try to do my, the best I can to rip the NFL up. My whole goal is to just come in and do whatever I can to, to wreck this whole league. And I remember the very first practice, Randy was running a deep route. And I'm half ready to go and say, no, no, you can't do it that way. No, we need for you. And that burst of speed, that height, that leaping ability, the hands, and you started, I'm like, no, no. Oh, okay. Yeah, you do it that way. And you found out very early that, you know what, this guy truly is unique enough that we can do things with him that even from a, an experienced coaching perspective, common sense would say, no, no, you need to do that different. Thanks, fellas. What's going on? 113. You hear me hit you in your chest enough? That means you got to feel good tonight. Monday night, you got to feel it. His rookie year, Green Bay, Monday night football. We threw down a jump ball. And he just, three guys draped on him, goes up and comes down, touchdown. And then we threw another deep pass. Really shouldn't have been thrown. You could have, as a coach, looked at the film and said, you shouldn't throw that ball. And it is Moss getting position, touchdown. And uh, Denny Green, one of my real mentors, kind of came over and go, why don't you do a bunch more of that? And when that ball's in the air, the number one thing you got to do is get it caught, no matter what. Get it caught and hold on to it. Make that damn official come pride out of your hands after you score a touchdown. All right, Randy, make him come pry it off. With the Vikings, Randy Moss set a rookie record for touchdown receptions with 17. Bomb downfield to Moss. Down there, juggles it. Oh, touchdown! Nine years later with the Patriots, he set the all-time single-season mark with 23. Throughout his career, he was always considered one of the league's most dangerous weapons but also one of its most explosive personalities. He's a sheer competitor. Come on! Hey! Don't stop giving me that ball! Don't stop giving me the ball! Come on! Damn, you can't throw him that high, bruh. All right, let it go. I'm gonna let that go, but I'm saying. All right, let's do it next time. Phenomenal athlete. That was one of the greatest catches Randy Moss has ever made. And I think those of us mortals who don't have those abilities, sometimes it's hard to discern the difference between that natural confidence born by that ability and what some would label as arrogance or conceit. Y'all know I don't stretch. So if everybody asks them why 84 ain't stretching, y'all know I don't stretch. Anybody pay attention to Viking football, 84 don't stretch on game day. I come ready. I came out the womb, I was ready. Tell him, Mama, you know I was ready. That's why you had me. We talk about an impact player. We talk about that player that you have to account for on every down. And we probably overuse it because there's really only a handful of guys. Randy Moss is one of those guys. And the threat that he has on any given play to kill you deep, the thing every defense is most worried about, he's a true difference maker. Moss was the leading scorer on the two highest scoring offenses of all time, the 1998 Minnesota Vikings and the 2007 New England Patriots. Randy Moss gets it, touchdown, what a spectacular catch. Fire it long and a fire it deep, Randy Moss in the end zone, touchdown! Another spectacular catch by this incredible football player. Legitimate guys that have legitimate numbers. I'll bet you he's in the top five in the fastest. Randy Moss breaks a tackle, and Randy Moss races down the sideline, and Randy Moss just outruns everybody into the end zone. He is incredible. The tallest. The highest leaping ability and the best hands. And Randy Moss just goes up and just makes it effortless. That freakish combination of those four, I don't think we've ever seen before. I'm not sure we'll see again.